former Murphy High School and Alabama football star is using his life to teach a lesson. Keith McCann's glory days were followed by a string of run-ins with the law. At one point, he was even profiled right here on Fox 10 News in our Fugitive Files. Well, today, he spoke with local high school students about the importance of making the right choice. Fox 10 News reporter April Douglas shares his message to students with you. Keith McCants once signed a $7 million contract to play professional football. Now he says he has nothing, not even his health. I was quick to step in front of the gun because you know why? I had no desire to live. A former Alabama football star says his fall from grace was a hard one. I made mistakes for a lot of people. On this national signing day, McCants told his story at Viger High School, hoping his mistakes will keep others from traveling his troubled past, a path that included arrest after arrest. McCants was even accused of throwing a crack pipe at police. And look at the records, I never got caught with drugs. I always got caught for paraphernalia. McCann says during his NFL days, he was forced to play in pain for fear of being replaced and stripped of his high-dollar contract. So he became an NFL hitman, a dirty player. The more morphine and more pain pills I was taking, the, the more I got lost on who I really was. Ironically, Keith McCann says his life changed for the better while he was in the Pritchard jail. McCann says he tried to take his own life while locked up in March of 2008. And when I was laying down, it hung myself, and Pritchard laid me down on the ground. When I cried out to God, I came up a new man, and I've been going strong ever since. And now he's trying to make right on years of poor choices by reaching out to others. God put me in places for a reason. And as I said, it was in the gutter. But I saved somebody life that day. He hopes sharing his story will be a way to put others on the right path. In Pritchard, April Douglas, Fox 10 News.